Hi, Subash from DSF.my, and this is the Isuzu T-Max X-Terrain, a new facelift model, and it's one of the few pickup trucks that are on sale today, but I think it really stands out, and here are a few reasons why. The first reason is this, the Isuzu brand itself. They've been making diesel engines since 1934, and the brand itself only focuses on trucks, pickup trucks and cargo trucks. So they're really specialists in this field. So if you want to get a pickup truck, this is the brand that you want to look for. They know what they're doing. And the second reason is this, the 4JJ 3-liter diesel engine. It's the last of its kind. Every other manufacturer is going smaller displacement. Isuzu has still found a way to make this engine Euro 4 compliant and still churning out a lot of power. 190 PS, 450 Newton meters of torque. If you really want top of the line performance in a pickup truck, this is the engine to go for. But if you're worried about you know, diesel prices and all that, they also have the smallest engine in the range, which is the 1.9 liter diesel. So they've got both extremes covered and uh, definitely worth considering. The third reason I think is the facelift just makes the exterior look so much more modern and a lot more eye-catching. So there's a new color, of course, you can see Namibu orange. Uh, really catches your eye, especially in a jungle setting like this. Nothing else is orange but this car. Uh, down here, you've got the same kind of fang look to the grill, but they've enhanced it. Now it's got a honeycomb uh, motif going on down here. And this new grill design is actually not just an aesthetic change, it's actually functional. Makes the whole pickup truck a little bit more efficient aerodynamically, and it also helps with the cooling because of the whole design here. Now, I think the best part about this front design is the headlamp. Uh, normally in facelifts, they keep the headlamps very slightly tweaked. You know, this one, they've changed a lot about this thing. Uh, the daytime running light now is the same strip as the turn signal indicator. So when the car is on, you see it white, and then you turn, you press the turn signal, and this becomes the turn signal indicator. It's a lot like a lot of the modern cars, the luxury cars that you see on the road today. This is a pickup truck. Also new is the hood design. They've re-stamped the metal here, which is a little bit more than a lot of companies will do for a facelift. It makes the entire front end really pop when you compare it to the pre-facelift model. And there's also another thing in the back. Now, around back, the taillights have a new design. It's a little bit different. It's still a triple decker design, but the shape is a little bit different. And this part here, this entire panel that goes up and down, well, they've taken the effort to redesign the back so the creases are now in different locations. And that, even though it sounds very small, is actually a big tooling difference for Isuzu. And it changes the design dramatically. So the interior was already pretty good before. It was the most luxurious pickup truck in its class. But I think Isuzu didn't want to just stop there. They wanted to go further. So if you really pay attention, you'll see that the seats have a new design. And also over here, the trim, you'll see a new Miura design. This is a Japanese kind of uh, traditional design that they've integrated into the trim pieces. You'll also find it on the door cards over there and over here. So you get a little bit more panache, a little bit more zing in the interior design. So even though it's a pickup truck, it has that little bit of premium flavor and Isuzu is not afraid to flex its muscles in this direction. Now, also in the interior, but a completely different aspect of the car is the technology. You've also got new technology in here with a seven inch digital instrument cluster. New design, looks a little bit more modern, a little bit more futuristic, but you've still got your trusty analog gauges left and right. Now, another tech aspect that is improved is the 360 degree monitor system. They call it all-around view monitor. You can activate it here with the ABM button. Um, but normally, when you're in tight space, it comes on by itself. The uh, cameras are very, very clear. You can actually manually select the ones you want to look at, which angle you want to look at. It's really useful, very high tech. Not something you find in your average pickup truck. And on the topic of tech, the displays and the infotainment has been upgraded massively in this facelift. So now it's a 10-inch unit on this X-Terrain model and it comes with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, now wireless for the first time. 
So this is something that a lot of premium cars still don't give you. And on a pickup truck, you get it on the flagship model. Very impressive. And it's not just the wireless aspects that have been improved. You now also have USB Type-C. Still got a trusty Type-A port there, but it's predominantly Type-C. So Type-C here, Type-C here, and I think there's a Type-C at the back as well. And for the facelift model, you also have lots of enhancements in terms of off-road capability. You have the terrain command module, so you can switch from two-wheel drive to all-wheel drive to four low with just a simple mechanism on the fly. Not only that, for the first time, you have a rough terrain mode. Just press one button and the gearbox, the engine, everything will sort itself out if you're going off-roading. And if it's really extreme situations, it's now got a diff lock as standard on all the all-wheel drive models. So you just press one button and the diff locks up the rear wheels. Very, very useful in tough situations. And the next aspect that is really impressive about the D-Max X terrain is the new generation stereo camera. So this is two cameras and now the field of view is 120 degrees. This is up from 40 degrees. So now the cameras can see more of the surroundings and you get a lot more improved ADAS functionality. So now you get turn assist with improved pedestrian protection as a result of this. On top of that, the D-Max also now gets rear cross traffic alert feature that is reserved for a lot of premium cars and that is now on the x -Terrain. Now on the facelifted models you get five years and 150,000 kilometers that's standard that's industry standard for warranties but for the x -Terrain model Isuzu Malaysia is going above and beyond. They're giving you seven years warranty and that's seven years and unlimited mileage so you can take this trucking you can take this uh, as a urban cowboys play toy uh, and for seven years you're covered Basically, head to toe, it's a worry-free product. Seven years, unbeatable, and definitely something that is setting this car apart from its competition. So that's why you should consider the Isuzu D-Max X Terrain. Thank you for watching.